Hi everyone, I haven't done a video for about a minute, but I thought I would show you my little baby dragon um, diamond painting. That was this one. And I got it finished a few days ago and I've just been kind of like chilling. I haven't done anything, I've been just kind of hanging out but so I thought I would share and then I have an unboxing to do for you as well this one comes from this company right here I'll put all the information down in the description box so you can see this was my first square diamond painting I've never done square before I wasn't sure I really liked it but um the little guy turned out so cute I wish I could find this in a larger size and I'm thinking about contacting the company and say hey you know what by chance can you make it bigger because um, it's a 30 by 40 and that is 12 by 16 so but he's actually super stinking cute and in all honesty I didn't mind doing all that black but so turned out just absolutely adorable and looks amazing in that reverse thing like when you put it in the mirror and look at it it looks absolutely fabulous so there's that little guy and he is just adorable so I've had these diamond paintings since um, I don't even remember when I bought them I, I ordered them on the 5th of October and they've been sitting in here since the 8th they arrived on the 8th and um, I ordered them all from Amazon and I opened up the, just like opened the, you know, the shipping box and what, or the bag and everything just to kind of get them out of the way. And this one, I'm not even sure what we have here, but I will put um, all the info down in the, in the description box. For where these came from because I ordered technically I ordered four on that day and three of them so far I'm throwing things sorry guys three of them so far have arrived and the, the three arrived on the same day on the 8th and I'm still waiting for the other one so not sure where that's coming from but so fairly typical how they show up Oh, I know which one this is. Okay, so it's a little hard to kind of tell what this looks like, but I did do. Hold on, got a picture. Please hold. That's what that looks like. And I'm thinking that's going to be a little hard to tell, but because we've got that glare from the from the light. But I'm not sure. I don't remember where this particular company was from, but that is what that's supposed to look like. And this one is round drills and, you know, the, the usual package, the little boat and the pen and the little wax. But the colors on that are kind of some nice colors in there. I know you guys can't see that, but and there's only 18 colors in this one, but we'll see what we what we get with that when that's finished. And I'm just gonna set this one aside for now because not my favorite one, but I, you know, I just wanted to do something fun. And then in that particular package, there was also a box. It amazes me how they, you know, everybody does their different strange packaging and that sort of thing, but so, hmm. Nice. Okay, well, we're going to see what we got here. So, this one is a 30 by 30. Two of those lovely little ditties. There's tweezers in that one. Um, a six space tool. Yeah, got to love that glare, right? Hold on, let's just take that out so you guys can see that. So, The six space tool, little tweezers, I don't use these, they just seem too incredibly lightweight, and the little boat with the hole cut out of the end, 
Not my favorite one, but you know what? Hey, got to do what you got to do, right? This one is called, and these two little, those are handy, Halloween Owl. So just please hold. We're going to have a quick look here. Okay. So this one, honestly, this is the first one I've ever received that has, that's her right there little halloween owl hang on i got a bigger picture so this is what she's supposed to look like super super cute and this one is only it's 30 by 30 which you know is actually only about a 12 by 12 but this is the first one that i've ever received that actually had the whole um tells you the quantity of the drills and that sort of thing so all of that but nice colors in there and so I'll have to go through and make sure everything's in there and this one is a square drill as well but let's have a quick look and see how she looks shall we so no. not much to see from that angle right including the glare but that's the side so let's see have a look from over here I can get a hold of that and this is it says jolly life diamond painting up there at the top but so that's not all bad and I know for some strange reason you guys are getting like a crazy freaking glare today usually I don't have glare but that's kind of cute so we'll see we'll see how she looks and it's kind of hard to tell, but actually the drill filled is fairly easy to read. And with the light from underneath, um, should not be a problem reading this one. But I just wanted something cute and quick and fast to do for Halloween, just for fun. And I think she is going to be absolutely adorable. So, and like I said, I will put all the information for that down in the description box so you guys can see that and um, we can go from there so we're going to scoop this out of the way and last but not least this one I ordered like I said around the same time and this is the box that showed up it was actually packed in the Amazon box and it says golden pano diamond painting right there and it's an AliExpress store. So there's that. And I will put this information in there. And I have to tell you, that was a little disconcerting. It's kind of like seriously rumpled and whatnot. But, um, you know, not that big of a deal in all honesty. Because they do flatten out really, really nice. Which one is this? Um... This one is way bigger than I was expecting. It's supposed to be, please hold, it's supposed to be this. And I wanted like just a small fun just to do, to have like, you know, to fuss around with during Christmas or like Thanksgiving when I was fixing dinner or doing something like that. And honestly, I swear I thought it was smaller, but it's this big, huge, look at this. So we'll go over that in just a second. And I'm kind of irritated that it was like folded in half. Seriously, folded in half like that and then rolled up instead of why didn't we just roll it, right? So it says diamond painting cross stitch. Here's the little picture on the side. And it is huge, absolutely ginormous. So I can't even fit it all in the screen and if you give me a minute I will tell you what we have for size I actually have to look that up okay hold on we're gonna have us a quick look over here and see what we have for size because like I said I was expecting like about an 8 by 10 size for these and um, I was really surprised when this showed up and I don't know how I managed but I clicked I just you know, wrong button all the way around when I did it. And mostly, you know, it's, it's relatively fine, but I was just like, okay, well, I was expecting, 
because I had a bunch in my cart and as I'm looking this one says it is 46 by 60 which is just over 16 by 24 so there you go 16 by 24 and I was looking at the one on there that had four small ones and they were about eight by ten and I swear that's the one I got and oddly they were about the same price as for the four as it was for this one but I honestly wasn't expecting <laughs> I wasn't expecting this great big thing and there's like 28 colors in there and square square drills I'm not overly thrilled with square drills but I'm thinking by the time I'm done with this one and uh, the ones that I have picked out I'll be all up on square drills by the time we're done. But same thing with the little kit. It's the boat with the cut hole in the end of it. Not my favorite, but you know, and then they're funky little tweezers, the wax, and then the, the pen and some of the really super lightweight bags, which is funny. We've got, what, four extra bags, five extra bags. Yeah, threw in five extra bags for 28 for 28 drills and they're the really super lightweight ones but you know what that's okay that's okay we've got lots of extras and there's no shortage of boats when you diamond paint so there's that um and you know the funny thing is the canvas on all three of these is actually surprisingly really good quality this one like i said is from an aliexpress um, seller and the canvas is really nice but that whole what's with the folding it in half and then rolling it up it should have just straight up been rolled up but so there's that cute little thing hopefully it looks as it should by the time I get it finished but uh, we'll see what happens and the drill filled on this actually is super easy to read super easy to read and I keep saying I'm gonna do ah, I'm gonna do a review on my light and I just haven't done that yet but you know what I will I will get that done for you guys and those are some seriously pretty seriously pretty little diamonds in there so we'll see what we could do with that when we get to that one so we're gonna sit down over there and last but not least I ordered this particular one and I have to laugh because my husband already pulled the outer package off of it but I ordered this one um, this is a paint with diamonds um, diamond painting and I ordered it on September 20th and it just got here today so that was quite some time and this one is huge this one is 50 by 100 and size wise that's 20 by 40 so pretty good size on this one so now i've got to get the rest of this untaped so we can have a peek at it and let's see what we have here so and this one is supposed to be a square drill i couldn't get it in a round because it doesn't come in a round and frankly if i could have bought it in a round i would have gotten that one but this is the way this one came so and I only ordered the one because it was a little bit expensive, but um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So there's that and that, and this can move out of the way. So I don't know if you guys can see that. Probably not. So let's go look at this first. It's the typical, the regular boat, um, wax, the little pen, and the little angle tweezers. I don't regularly use those. I use a set from uh, Who Cannon. And uh, let's have a quick look here. There are a pile of drills in this one. So. And you guys can see that just by looking. There are a lot of them in there. Two huge bags. Um, one of the 310 and one of 229. Big, huge bags of those. So there's that. 
going to take a bit to inventory those, but this is what we have. So we have 40 colors and I don't know if you can see that. I printed one. Hopefully you can see mine a little bit better. That's called My Harley and it's a paint with diamonds. 50, 100 by 50 and we'll see how this one is going to go. But So I need to get this tape off of here. Hold on. So there's one. There's one. Give us a second. And this one has a the like foam tube on the inside of it to roll it up. One would hope somewhere along the way some of the other companies could sort that out, figure out that that might be a really good idea to do. But we're going to see what we have here for a drill filled. Okay, so this one is probably the largest one that I have ever attempted. And like I said, we're not even getting to the end of it yet here. So, just for the sake of argument, we're going to have us a little look. Wow. Not sure how I feel about that, but it is a rather dark diamond painting anyway. But, you know, I have to tell you, those little icons are actually relatively easy to read and I'm thinking with the light behind this, this is probably going to be super simple to read which is nice even though they are like really dark um, we'll see how that looks let's have a look down here hmm I can see that that is the wheel let's see We'll find out. You know, glutton for punishment, right? We'll see what happens. Let's see what happens. I may just like straight up tell the husband, like, you know what? You're going to have to help me. <laughs> oh, he wanted the Harley. We're still getting to the other side. Hold on. There we go. So we are over here at the other end. And you can see how far it is that this goes doesn't even fit all in the camera there we go so like I said that one is 40 inches across and 20 inches tall let's see let's see if we can see anything up in this corner up here that one could look at and actually tell what it is hmm not sure picture so those are supposed to be what look like paintings up here hanging maybe in a building on display or something like that so yeah we'll see what happens we'll see what happens but for now I'm thinking we're just gonna have to deal with this but there's the bottom of the bike so, there's that. And this one is really ultra sticky because sticky even stuck to my thumb. So, we'll see what happens, guys. We'll see what happens. So, there's that. And we'll see how that goes. But for right now, this one's just going to get so that it can flatten out a little bit and we'll go from there and see how that turns out and I'm going to inventory I will let you guys know if everything was in there as it should be and um, we'll go from there but for now I'm thinking we're just gonna look at this little guy 
because he is so stinking adorable. But look at that. Yeah, super cute. This one's going to be the major undertaking. So we'll see what happens. Okay, thanks everybody for watching. I promise I will get that review done for the light and we'll go from there. So thanks for watching. Bye now.